Temple became a reality for many Hoosiers last night in Randolph and Delaware counties. Seeing this video, you can see it through the clouds there, that funnel cloud, that tornado captured on video as this EF3 storm began speeding through several local communities. Fox 59's Jenny Dreisler joins us from Winchester, one of the hardest hit areas from last night's storm. The damage here in the gaslight addition is extensive. You have homes that are completely leveled. You have cars that are totaled. You have trees uprooted. And I spoke to numerous people who live here today who described Thursday night's tornado as one of the scariest experiences of their lives. And they say that they're thankful that nobody died as this could have been a lot worse. In the grand scheme of things, I can replace stuff. I can't replace my my family and my friends. Angie Martin says she's lucky to be alive. Her home was completely leveled by Thursday's EF3 tornado in Winchester. Martin was out of town when the storm hit and came back Friday to salvage what was left. I kind of just felt numb, like just complete disbelief, but my youngest, her favorite stuffed animal was out in the middle of the yard, and that's really the only thing that she that she really wanted, but all of our animals were safe. Down the street, Jackie Welch was home and hid in her bathroom when the tornado hit. Fighting tears, she described the experience as best she could. I wasn't sure I was going to make it out. I was very frightened, and I was yelling for help. I'm sick, but I'm thankful to be alive. And further down the road, Beth Moland and her husband were home at the time, too. I said, get in here now. He barely got in there, shut the door. And five seconds later, it, we just got poured on, rained on, but with insulation. All across the gaslight edition, neighbors told me the devastation was palpable. Piles of rubble, homes wiped off the street. But the one thing you did see was yeah. Hoosiers helping Hoosiers, all grateful to be alive. And everyone here told me that's all anyone can ask for. It's a God thing. There's, there's no other explanation. Everything just kind of fell in place because he was looking out for us. That's all there. That's all there is to it. People who live here tell me the cleanup is expected to take months and many of them are staying with family and friends and they tell me they're grateful for all the extra help. If you want to help, just click on this story on our website at fox59.com. In Winchester, Jenny Dreisler, Fox 59 News.